Hello, everybody. Hope everybody's having a great weekend. Uh, just coming at you with another update for the next week ahead of us. We got uh, just a few bits of general info and we'll get into it. But uh, five weeks to go now. So it's uh, pretty awesome. We're getting along great. Um, five full, five full five day weeks coming up ahead. Uh, and that's kind of the big deal going on. So keep it up. Keep working. Keep working hard till the end, everybody. Uh, we do have a baseball project going on. Just want to, I guess, update parents. Kids are doing a great job with it. Uh, it's more of a self-guided um Create your own baseball team, get as creative as you want with a team name and designs and creating a stadium. The kids are having a lot of time, a lot of fun making like a 3D model of their stadium and things like that. Um, more of a self-guided kind of project we're doing is sort of a Halo Bell enrichment kind of thing. And I just really wanted to mention it because kids are having a great time even asking when do we get to do it next? When are we going to work on it again? Um, so we're trying to take a couple of times at least of our those en enrichment periods each week to get them working on it. So it's been going great. They're doing an awesome job. Love that they're kind of self-motivated and choosing their own path about what which areas they want to focus on. That's been really good. So awesome with that. Um, as far as regular classes this week going on, uh, math, we're going to get more and more into fractions because did a great job kind of transitioning into those last week. Uh, we've talked about fractions in simplest form and finding equivalent fractions. And now we're going to use that to find common denominators so that we can add and subtract those fractions, um, which uh, I think it will go just fine. Again, we did a lot of setup last week and kind of brushing up on some of the things they covered uh last year during the quarantine time and uh really looking forward to that continuing so uh we'll be making some good progress there uh in science we're going to wrap up ecosystems this week so we'll be kind of moving out of um life science into some physical science stuff after that but uh for this week we're going to get some more practice with food webs and energy pyramids especially uh last week we watched a documentary about yellowstone national park and some of the amazing wildlife there and how that fits into energy pyramids and food webs and the interactions that take place in the ecosystem. Uh, we'll do some more things like that just to identify those different parts of the uh, of the ecosystem. Um, and then we'll be ready to move on. In English, we're working on personal narratives. Last week, we did a lot of uh, outlining and creating graphic organizers and focusing in on some key details uh, before we actually write the rough draft. So now what we're going to do is take all that work we've kind of done and organized into uh, forming it into paragraphs and hopefully practice some peer editing if we can get those those rough drafts uh, taken care of. So that's kind of the big thing there. Uh, they're doing a good job working through that. Again, we're kind of slowing down through this one and just making sure we focus on those, uh, you know, basic things, pre-writing kind of stuff uh, before we eventually get to that final copy. Um, and that's about it that's going on. So everybody hope you have a great week. Uh, again, we got a, another five day week coming up. It's all ready the last uh, week of April, which is awesome and amazing. And I will see you soon. Thanks again. Talk to you soon. Bye bye.